Hey, my beautiful friends, it's another marvelous day, and today's motivation is titled Produced for Greatness. So, of course, let's get into it. Hey, welcome or welcome back to my tribe. This channel was created to make you smile and of course, motivate you to live your best life. So today's motivation should do just that. I just finished a week long consecration and it has been a long time since I was this close to God. I have been desiring to do a consecration for the longest time, but although my spirit was willing, my flesh continued to be very weak. I was nervous though, why? Because I didn't want to fail. I wanted to succeed. I was tired of falling. I was tired of falling short. I was tired of saying yes to God, but also saying yes to my flesh. I made the choice to follow through. Maybe that's today's motivation. Follow through with your goal. Don't give up. It's difficult, I know, but believe me, we have to push past our emotion and recognize that everything we need is in the will of the Father. With that being said, during this consecration, I asked the Lord to reframe the way I think, change the way I interact with people, and catapult me into my greatness. It's so ironic that when I decided to make this decision, the enemy created very much amazing opportunities to distract me. I was recently faced with a task at work that caused me to reflect upon myself. I almost went into a depression, but then I realized God is producing greatness in the person that acts for it. Last year this time, if the same situation happened to me, I promise I would have reacted completely different. But I didn't. I grew. I became greater than I was last year. I'm not in that place anymore. Greatness was produced in me. So I remember a scripture in Romans 8, 28-30 that says, We know that all things work together for the good of those who love God, those who are called according to His purpose. For those He foreknew, He also predestined to be conformed to the image of Him his son so that he would be the firstborn among many brothers and those he predestined he also called those he called he justified and those he justified he also glorified here is the motivation there is a process to your greatness you must trust that process go the distance go the distance through the hurdles the slips and sometimes even the falls however you must trust your journey and the orchestrator of the road you travel God is producing greatness in you. The Bible says that those he created, he called. God has called you by name, not by accident, but for a purpose. He didn't just call you, he justified you, meaning he marked you here on this earth for a specific reason. Lastly, he glorifies us. Glorifies means to be lifted up as special. God has lifted you up above every problem and every stressful situation in your life. You are special to him. You are created, you're called, you're marked, you're lifted up. That to me, my friend, is a process. You're going through a process toward greatness. Hear me, hear me. Although this is a process, we are born with greatness. That's why the Bible said that all things work together for the good of those who are called. That's you, the one who was called, called to be great for his glory. When you face something that is uncomfortable, that's called a process of God producing more out of you. He's pulling it out to the point that you don't even realize that you have the ability to win every time. So go be great. Walk with your head held high. If you can think it, it can be done. If you can face it, you can overcome it. So keep trusting that process. If you receive something from today's motivation, go ahead and hit that like button. It will help me reach more people. Leave a comment by answering this question. Did you hear something from today's motivation that stuck out to you? Let's chat about it. Lastly, do me a favor and share, share, and share. <laughs> share this video with your friends, your family, and your social media. Someone may need to hear this motivation to be reminded of how special they are to God. As I always say, give someone a call and let them know that you love them and show them that you care. That may be the one time they hear it or see it. Remember guys, love is an action word. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for future motivations and content. I love y'all for watching and I will see y'all in the next motivation. Peace.